Clearwater Marine Aquarium is getting ready to open up a brand new manatee rehabilitation center. ABC Action News reporter Casey Albright learning how much the new center is needed and how it's going to make a difference. They're special animals. They're so gentle, so they're, they're just amazing creatures to watch. They're just, I feel relaxed when I watch them. Neil and Loretta Brace Griddle come to Florida every few years and say manatee health should be a priority. It's very important for this area to kind of keep your wildlife as best, you know, in as best possible shape as they can be. Manatees get hit by boats, they succumb to red tide, and over the past couple of years, though it's improving now, we've had manatees that needed to be rescued because of environmental changes on the east coast of Florida. Dr. James Powell is the chief zoological officer at Clearwater Marine Aquarium and says when a manatee is injured, employees are only able to help transport manatees to another location for rehabilitation. Sadly, we may get um, a report of a manatee that needs rescued, you know, practically every week or every couple of weeks. But now the Clearwater Marine Aquarium will soon be able to help manatees right on site with a brand new rehabilitation center. Clearwater Marine Aquarium officials say the new rehabilitation center that's right behind me can hold up to at least six manatees and help those manatees recover and then release them back into the wild. Workers are currently building the pools and medical centers for the manatees. And Dr. Powell says the new facility will make a big difference. What we do that's good for manatees is also very good for ourselves too because it's protecting um, this resource that we have in terms of our beautiful waters in Florida. The aquarium is also opening a rehabilitation center in Belize after reports of many manatees getting injured by boats in the area. Aquarium leaders say the rehabilitation center in Clearwater will be finished in April and workers will break ground on the Belize center this summer. We want our grandchildren to be able to see these That's animals. Good point. We want them to have the joy that we have when we see them. So that's important. I'm Pinellas County reporter Casey Albert and ABC Action News.